this system is making my life so much easier, especially as a solo business owner. Well, what's happening here? First of all, the platform that we have is make.com and I'm using it. You can use it for free pretty much. So what happens here is I have a system that's basically my AI social media assistant. All right. So I send my voice notes to it. It cleans up the audio and it prepares posts for me and it sends them on multiple platforms. You can do all of this for free. So I'm going to give a quick demo and then we're going to talk about it. All right. So it's basically you run it. It captures my audio notes from Google Drive. It runs it two times through ChatGPT, OpenAI, creates documents for me, and it posts stuff, right? So what happened here, what you just saw, it was like really fast instantly. It's like I pick up audio notes from my drive. Um, it created a document for me that you're seeing here with a timestamp. It looks something like this. And then it published it on Buffer. It's one of the platforms that this one is a great platform, by the way, Buffer. So I'm not affiliated with them, but... It, you can use it for free pretty much for up to three platforms. So I use it basically for Twitter and LinkedIn, but you can also add Instagram to the mix. All right. Why is the system valuable? Because a lot of times I go on social media to post something and I get caught in the timeline and I consume, I consume, and then I get like either a headache or like I get all this cheap dopamine and I want to avoid this, right? So that's why I want to just focus deeply go for a nice walk in the park, have a nice talk with my phone, you know, leave a voice note, and then all of this gets posted on social media, gets scheduled, gets cut into pieces, and gets cleaned up. So this is exactly what's happening here, right? So let's go back to it and search, a, check a bit together what's happening, right? So information is being perceived from Google Drive, as I saw, as I showed you, um, is being run, first of all, through Whisper um, to basically write it properly, right? Because this is just audio file. And then I run it again through OpenAI as my um, transcriber, as you can see here, right? So it goes through social media pretty much. I'm telling it specific instructions with a specific prompt. And then it gets sent to another OpenAI. So basically another chat GPT that breaks it down bite-sized pieces and then gets sent to Buffer. So another one here would be for LinkedIn. And you can add just another one also to Instagram. And this is customizable, by the way. That's the cool thing. Because you can even add, for example, like another OpenAI module to create images for you. So you can have images for those posts. Another important note, why is this significant? Because this is not um, AI replacing me. This is not just some like cheap AI garbage post with hashtags and emojis. This is just my knowledge, my thoughts, but in a much faster way. Like I'm being accelerated by AI because it's taking my smart thoughts, it's cleaning them, and it's putting them in a written form. It's scheduling them for me. All of this normally you would do it, for example, with a VA, a human, and you'd pay them. But the system is free pretty much because you can run Make for free. You can run Buffer for up to three platforms for free. You just need to know a bit of prompt engineering and automation, like I'm basically showing you today here with this little tutorial and walkthrough. All right, so if you're interested, let me know in the comments if you want the blueprint for this. I can try to give you some resources, some hints in the right direction. Let me know in the comments or DMs on social media. And I think it's very valuable, this kind of system, especially for a business owner or freelancer, because I don't want to spend my whole day also like, you know, writing posts, scheduling them, uh, paying for all these subscriptions, because these scheduling um, tools, for example, some of them are between 20 to $50. Again, this is free, what you're seeing here. And it just uses, you know, like smart AI pretty much to help me post much faster and better. Because then I can actually deep focus on my stuff. As I said, I'm going on a long walk in the park, which I did yesterday pretty much. I talk with it extensively, my ideas, and it just refines them for, for me. Because even here, I can add more steps for, to tell it, for example, like remove the sections that are weak, um, add something a bit more punchy, you know, highlight important words, which I kind of did, for example, like here. I'm telling it the way that's supposed to talk, right? So if it's a question, you should figure it out. Some words are all caps. So it did a pretty decent job. You can see here what it emphasized, how it's uh, breaking it down. And again, you're seeing here the different modules, right? So it pick, it's picking up um, audio files from my Google Drive. And these audio files, again, with just my phone, I just uh, talk quickly. I send them to my drive. That's it. It picks them up automatically. Um, it runs them through Whisper automatically. It runs them through the transcriber by itself automatically, the prompt is here, and then it sends it to, for example, here could be LinkedIn, 
I'm not doing it yet, but I will do it in the next days because there I had like a much longer prompt. I want to refine this even more, the system. Here, for example, I'm telling it if it's too long for Twitter, make it shorter and cut it into pieces. Put it also in a doc, right? Because again, it's not like I want it all the time to post this stuff, but I do want to have my thoughts in a place with timestamps to know when did I talk about this, what's the topic, and then I have everything there in a nice format. And then, yeah, here I have like basically the connection with Buffer to Twitter that you're seeing here, right? And it's just posting stuff for me. You can even add media to it. And yeah, Buffer, you can see it here. I decide when to schedule my posts and they're being sent here by this automation. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you're interested in more of this kind of stuff. Let me know in the comments if you want this, if you need more help with this. And uh, yeah, I built this basically first for myself because I needed it because I don't want to scroll so much and spend so much time on social media. And this is helping me. So I wish you a blessed day. Ciao.